Time for another Costco Keto Haul. This time we're going to look at breakfast foods that they sell at Costco marked Keto Friendly. What are your favorites? Let's go! Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel where we talk about quick and easy, delicious, nutritious, and low carb food. Please like and subscribe and I'll bring you new videos every week. Since breakfast is the first meal of the day and literally means to break your fast, it is crucial that we look at nutritious and keto-friendly items. Of course you can get bacon, eggs, and sausage, but what I'm gonna focus on are quick and easy options for breakfast on the go. Starting with hot foods, we have egg bites. These are super easy, pop them in the microwave for 90 seconds and you have a delicious breakfast to go. At only one gram of net carbs per serving and a fraction of the price as a Starbucks, these are a definite winner. Here's a relatively newer item. It's Red's Egg Witch Turkey Sausage Breakfast Sandwich. Ready in about two minutes and at three net grams of carbs per serving. What's not to love? Two thumbs up. Now, if you're looking to make your own breakfast wrap or breakfast burrito, these egg wraps with cauliflower are a great option to have on hand for both breakfast or lunch. At zero net carbs and quite low in calories, two thumbs up. Here's a recent find, which is the Birch Bender Pancake and Waffle Mix. Just add water and you're on your way to make some low carb waffles or pancakes at five grams of net carbs per small serving. I'll give it one thumb up. While we're on the subject of cake mixes, I found this keto and paleo friendly brownie mix. Now you do need to add your own butter, milk and eggs and do some baking. But can I eat brownies for breakfast? Sure, why not? At two grams of net carbs per serving, I'll give it one thumb up. Moving on to cold breakfast foods, here's a great keto yogurt option by Ratio Company. I'll put a link to the review video in the description below. Add two grams of net carbs per cup. These are quite good. For our yogurt topping, here are two great options. One is the Purely Elizabeth Vanilla Almond Butter Granola. While marketed as both keto and paleo, in a third cup serving, it does contain seven grams of net carbs, coming from the coconut sugar. While fine for a sprinkling on top of yogurt, if you're watching your carbs, may not be the best option for a full meal. For a lower carb option, there's a low carb keto nut granola. And in this case, it's a blueberry cinnamon flavor. At three grams of net carbs per third cup serving, this may be a better alternative for a cereal-like replacement. Speaking of cereal milk, we're gonna need a milk replacement. And I found this one as a keto-friendly Milkdamia Macadamia Milk, which is a great replacement for regular milk on the skim milk consistency side. I have a review video and I'll put links to that in the description below. I like that it's low in calories, only 40 calories per cup, very little carbohydrates, less than one gram, and it's fortified with calcium and vitamin D. Now my Costco also had two versions of the Kirkland brand almond milk. The first one is an organic almond milk that's unsweetened, but flavored with vanilla. While at one gram of net carbs per serving and 30 calories, it does not have the fortification of calcium, at least not to the extent of the macadamia milk. The other Kirkland brand milk here is a regular almond milk, unsweetened, unflavored, also at 30 calories per cup with one gram of carb per serving. Now this one is fortified with calcium, giving two great options for milk. One thumb up. And finally, for true breakfast on the go, here are the no sugar keto bars at three net 
grams of carbs per bar, these are a great pick-me-up in the morning when you're running out of the door. One thumb up. As an added bonus, the No Sugar Company also makes the Keto Cups, and now they have three more flavors. Dark Chocolate Caramel, Dark Chocolate Mint, and Dark Chocolate Hazelnut. While not necessarily a breakfast food, at one gram of net carbs per serving, these are great for a snack anytime. So what are your picks for your favorite keto breakfast foods? That's it for another video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and have a great day.